Hi, my name is Felix Offensberger. I'm a PhD candidate at the Ludwig Maximilians Universität in Munich. I'd like to present my work. Here, Empire R, a model-free, reliable analysis of higher order differentials and complex replicate count data. Nowadays, projects become increasingly complex with many perturbations and conditions as dimensions. Complex experimental designs of RNA-seq data have to be simplified for statistical analysis to one versus one and one versus all differential comparisons. Standard methods rely on model assumptions. Differential expression significance is based on questionable null hypothesis testings, which is employed on default thresholds. Empire R is a R-based version of Empire S, also presented here at the ISMB. In contrast to conventional methods for differential expression of replicate data, like the ESEC tool, which are using model assumptions to, to compute the ranked gene list, the fold change, and p value, Empire R employs a fuzzy value based representation of count data. By fuzzy binning, it estimates empirical error error distributions of the data. It computes fuzzy fold changes, FFCs, based on the consistency of a feature compared to the rest of the data in the same condition, FFC rep, and the cross conditions, FFC cont. Resulting not only in a ranked gene list, but also in a categorical assignment of the features combining consistency and effect in differential expression into code matrices. The calculation is fully transparent and insights can be viewed in appropriate visualizations. Empire R employs a fuzzy value-based representation of the count data, assigning the signals into linguistic variables via appropriate membership functions of fuzzy sets. Here, for example, into noise, low, medium, and high. Linguistic variables are user-defined to enhance interpretability of data, effect, and consistency. In a later step, the classification is not only based on the signal, but also on the fold change resulting in a 3D fuzzy membership functions. The fold changes of each feature are assigned to bins representing the fuzzy sets according to their membership in this fuzzy set. With these bins, characteristics of the fuzzy set can be measured, such as the mass, mean, and standard deviation, which are therefore empirical for the data. They build the basis for calculation of the best like plots and the empirical z-scores, which are later the borders for new fuzzy sets, resulting into statements of differential change, seen at the previous slide. Comparing fuzzy fold change distributions within one condition, left, with the one across conditions, right, effect size differences and trends can be seen clearly on the right, while between the replicates there only should be the technical bias. On the right, we are confronted with technical and biological bias plus the effect. In the consistency differential expression uh, table, features are categorized for consistency into three classes, non-consistent, questionable, and consistent, and the effect into strong ups, up, neutral, down, and strong down. When considering only the technical bias across the conditions left, there are lots of genes with high effect classes. While when considering the technical and biological bias, the features are more centered towards a neutral effect. Each of the different classes from the code table are accessible in an app. And detailed information of the features are visible as the concrete signals and fold changes. And the 2D representation of the 3D falsification of the fuzzy fold changes. Here on the left for within one condition and here on the right across conditions with the background of the replicates and the background of the condition. In total, we have a p-value free analysis for differential changes of count data with interpretable 
differential expression categories and the re reliable model-free scoring of consistency and effect size. An interactive visualization of calculations and results. This is not only applicable to counts, but because of its empirical nature, also to all kinds of omics data, fold changes and higher order differential. Discrete higher order differentials allow insights into complex project designs. This is not only important for bigger projects, but also for comparisons with one within one experiment. For example, hill value comparisons in attack footprint search. The fuzzy value representation of the results is perfectly fitted, fitted for complex patterns as in time series. He bare used them for fuzzy flows in Sankey diagrams seen to mm, at the ECCB. This is the end of the presentation. Thank you very much for the opportunity to present my work here at the ISMB. Special thanks goes to my supervisors, Evi Berchtold and Ralf Zimmer, for the topic, but also for the help throughout the entire project. Thank you.